And this is the scene here at the Emirates Stadium in North London. And I'm delighted to be able to report that it's a perfect day weather-wise. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And leading the line today, Alexandre Lacazette. And a bit short with the clearance. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this takes it on. Sensational goalkeeping from David De Gea. Trying to deliver it accurately. United have it once again. Maguire. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Fred. Encouraging stuff from United. In position. And tipping it over the crossbar. Corner awarded. <laughs> Taken short. Ronaldo. And back with Fred. Come off the keeper. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, do you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek? They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Granit Jacker. Arsenal couldn't keep the ball. And it might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. It's going to be United's free kick. Sancho. On to Ronaldo. Oh, disappointing. Just when it looked like a surefire opener. Well, that should have been the opener, Derek. I'm not sure how he's missed that. Well, as you can see, United have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes and created a hat full of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Scott McTominay. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them back. And he's through here. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Who can they pick out? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Fred. McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. Can he play it in? So a throw in here.
Cristiano Ronaldo. Teammate available. Bruno Fernandes. Very comfortable when in possession. Ronaldo. Oh, wonderful save. Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. They take it short. Bruno Fernandes. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, as you can see, this was always coming. They've been piling on the pressure. It's a well-deserved goal. On they go again, and Arsenal know they need to wipe out that last goal. And waiting for teammates to arrive on the scene. Well, the perfect tackle, really, and now a throw-in. Saka. Chance to cross. Makes his way in field. Pulls it back to the clutches of the goalkeeper he's going forward well here this could level it and that's a very good parry and an effective clearance and the whistle is sounded for half time in this game Cristiano Ronaldo was a big part of the build-up to this one, and he hasn't disappointed, Stuart. Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Bruno Fernandes. Cristiano Ronaldo. Scott McTominay. Sancho now. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, lovely ball. Ronaldo. Could be. Terrific piece of anticipation. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Jadon Sancho. On to Ronaldo. No, high quality defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Defenders need to cover. Lacazette. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. White. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. And the cross is very much on. And a timely intervention. Bruno Fernandes. Jaden Sancho. Diogo Dallo on the ball. And they find a gap in the defence. He's in here. Well, he was on his own. He had the goalkeeper to beat, but failed to do so. Well, he just needed to show a bit more composure there. Take a little bit off the shot, I think. Substitution for well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Number 31, 
Thomas Partey. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Well, an easy one to cut out, really. Bruno Fernandes. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Ben White. 20 minutes remaining. Sancho. Ronaldo. Goalkeeper should take charge. He has time to play it over. Fred. Ronaldo. They really look after the ball when they have it. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Well, these Arsenal fans can sense an equaliser here. Can the players respond and get it? Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Making sure it didn't get past him. Well, potential danger. Ben White. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, it was close, but offside nonetheless. Well, it's a matter of inches there, but he just went a fraction too early. Well, the referee remaining very much in control. Now the card, and it's yellow. Here's a change for Manchester United. Well, nearing the end of the game, and Arsenal with work to do, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, I think their forward play has been poor today. They've not had enough movement from the front players, and the midfield have been too safe with their passing. Unless that changes in these final few moments, they'll get nothing from this game. Nicola Pepe. It's with Gabriel. It's a perfect challenge. Matic. Bruno Fernandes. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Great pressure to win the ball back. Ronaldo, Jaden Sancho, oh surely, and up for grabs off the keeper, oh chance taken, there is opportunism for you, but a disappointed goalkeeper. Well here we can see it again, normally I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save, I'm not sure he could have done much more, just a bit unfortunate really that it dropped to an opponent. into the books as a defeat for Arsenal. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the ball in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out.